Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Laura Harris. We're back on the show floor of 2023 NADA, and we're here in Dallas, Texas. And I was able to speak with Cox Automotive President Steve Rowley. Now, right behind me, you can see Cox Automotive has their booth. It's one of the biggest booths here. And I got to talk to Rowley about future business strategies and how Cox is staying competitive in the marketplace. When you walk on the floor, you can feel the energy. There's a lot going on, uh, a lot of people here, so the attendance is high, and uh, you can't help but uh, get excited. Raleigh says the show is an opportunity to showcase the company's talents, products, people, and bring exciting things to the auto industry. We've got an opportunity to have our customers come here in uh, large volumes and really, really put that on display. When it comes to the marketplace, Raleigh wants to stay competitive. And Cox does that by staying innovative, using new technology, and listening to their customers. So much of our innovation is driven by our customers. So as our customers are looking for new items, as we see challenges coming out, we're always innovating and bringing products to the marketplace to stay ahead of the curve. One of Cox's biggest launches is Retail 360. Raleigh says it's the car buying journey that creates a lot of efficiencies and profitability for the dealer. Another innovation is Profit Time GPS, a tool that allows dealers to understand what cars to buy, when to buy, and when to sell. And when it comes to the future of digital retailing... Well, digital retailing to me is uh, paramount for success. Uh, you know, I think all of us uh, buy things online and continue to give the confidence and buy bigger and bigger things. That's all we have today. Thanks for watching, everyone. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at Autonews TV and online at Autonews.com for updates from our reporters all day, every day. We'll have more NADA coverage throughout the week. I'm Laura Harris reporting in Dallas Automotive News.